Hey guys, it's Dane with DynastyBreaks.com. Hit that thumbs up button, hit the subscribe button. We appreciate the channel love. When you hit thumbs up, YouTube knows you like our channel. They will show it to other uh, people that maybe don't know about Dynasty Breaks. Thank you, and uh, email me. My email address is going across the scroll up top, DynastyBreaksLLC at gmail.com. If you want to sell your cards on the Fanatics Collect weekly auctions, we are now consigners. Uh, you can send me that email, say, Dane, I want to sell some stuff. I got some stuff I want to grade before I sell it. We can help you with that, too. Send me an email. Uh, just broke a couple records this last Sunday on uh, a specifically a Puka Nakua card that went for over 2000 bucks. Very nice. We're doing a 21, 22, 23 Topps Chrome Platinum Anniversary Edition. Let me, let me show you the box. I like how these boxes look. Um, this is in the uh, throwback designs from the 1950s. Uh, here are your teams. Josh with the Padres and Guardians. Michael White Sox. Josh Mariners. Blake with the Twins. Scott D-backs. Travis Ropen in the Cubs. Josh Tigers and Rockies. Christopher um, picking his toenails. It's a bad habit. Um, we, we do have a recovering toenail picker. In, in chat. Her name is Carly. She can help you out, Chris. Uh, Nationals, uh, James the Rat. Get out your decon. Angels are Bryce of the Cardinals. Adam Vinatieri, one of the greatest kickers of all times. Uh, Marlins. Timmy with the Mets. Joshua Braves. Aaron at the bar with the Pirates. Scott, Rangers and Blue Jays. Joshua Wiley Coyote with the uh, Dodgers. Paul, PAR Brewers. Christopher A's. Joe Astro. Scott with the Giants. Raymond covered in a white gelatinous goo. Phillies, uh, Paul with the Royals, El Rey Sonomali with the Reds, DJ, DJ Hole. He's working my next uh, my next party event. DJ Hole, uh, Red Sox, and uh, Josh Van with the Yankees, Rays, and Orioles. All cards ship, no hitless credit. We're doing 2021 first. We won't tell you the theme for Dane's next party. Yeah, you don't want to know. You don't want to know, bro. No, we don't. Bro. What do you mean? Trevor's not too smart, guys. Just letting you know. <laughs> That's why we got him working by himself. What do you mean? <laughs> uh, all right. It is the second break of the evening. It is time, as is Dynasty tradition, for you to tell us in the chat, or if you're watching this video later, tell me in the comments. I want to know, what are you having for dinner tonight? I want to know the main course. I want to know the side dishes. I'd like to know how it's prepared. Are you having dessert? Throw that in. What are you having to drink? Leave it in the comments. And uh, Trevor will be judging very badly. We'll be judging the uh, the winner. Dane uh, can't judge because Dane has no taste. So I used to get to judge sometimes, but Trevor's very domineering. Domineering. If you saw what Dane ate on a daily basis... You don't understand why. I ordered Jason's deli today. Wow. I had a salad? A, no, I had a spicy chicken wrap. How do you like that? You, you've been going to the wraps a little bit lately, haven't you? Uh, yeah. You had a rapid Buffalo Wild I used to Wings. I used to watch uh, Yo! MTV raps. And I used to, uh, um, you know, I, make sometimes... A fool, it, make a fool of yourself. Sometimes at Christmas I like, you know, I like wrap stuff up and then... Uh, um, every now and then, people are mean to me. Like, Carl, I get a bad rap. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I ordered the chicken wrap is what I did. It's a different spell completely different. Hall, what are you doing? Hall's over at the bar. What are you doing, What's Hall? What's up, Hall? All right, Lyle coming in with the cheese ravioli and meat sauce, garden salad with Thousand Island, breadsticks, bowl of soup. It's soup and salad. Wow. Sounds like you're at a Olive Garden. Sausage, potato, and kale cream soup. You know why I'm doing this, Hall? Or, uh, free. Lyle? Thank you for your service, by the way. There you go. Olive Garden for Veterans Day. How did I call it? Because you read it. Um, I didn't read that. Subconsciously. Thousand Island is why I'm making that face. Thousand yes. Island. Thousand Island's good. I love Ooh. it. So good. So thank good. you for your service. Yeah, thanks for your service, Wild. All you veterans out there, thank you. Just might make a sandwich for dinner with some maybe onion rings and Miller Lite. Well, that's cool. There's Kyle being a creeper. Howdy, folks. I just had a Josh sandwich. This pe uh, okay. Inch thick pork chop, no sides needed. Says Meryl. Down with the sides. I don't need a side when I got an inch thick pork chop. That's what she said. Just All right. Just on the meat and the, it 
Are you out in the yard? Okay, stop. <laughs> they got you Larry Walker. Chain. Larry Walker. Gnawing on that piece of meat. All right, we're we're breaking cards now. Uh, Tom Hatch. He just came out of an egg. I don't know if you guys do. That's why he's on the Blue Jays. Just came out of an egg. Bryce Harper looking handsome. There you go, Crystal. Crystal's okay. crush there. People want to hear that. Looking handsome. <laughs> so handsome. All right. Uh, Bo Bichette refractor. Anyone who eats burgers with the fork is disqualified. Exactly, Carly. Oh, exactly. exactly. Oh, that's what they're doing. Exactly. Chaka, chaka. Uh, all right, Dennis Eckersley with a very strange tan. Kyle, that's weird. Just want to say uh, this is a blue mini diamond refractor, and it looks like he's been at the beach all, all week. Just saying. Um, he's been out and about. Got Kyle Stein in the eye with Jersey Mike's chips and a Mountain Dew. Uh, does Aaron Savali look happy to be on this baseball card? You tell me, guys. I think I need to have a little talk with him. Uh, number to 99. Did a pot of chili, home fries, carrot cake, fresh limeade. Hey, you're leading, Elroy. Does leading the carrot the cake has ra have raisins in it, Elroy? Sorry, I have to Typical know. Typical carrot cake doesn't. Mm. No, it doesn't. Most carrot cake I've had has got little raisins floaties, floaties in it. Uh, that's not a good picture. This dude has a large Adam's apple. You're saying? I think that's okay. Has, I think he has multiple chins. Maybe he? No, I think he was. I think he was swallowing something. All right. Uh, this is Rick Porcello refractor. Merrill, that sounds like my father used to eat three days. <laughs> uh, Jorge uh, okay. Posada, that is an Aqua Wave. Trevor's favorite hairspray, Aqua Wave. One of those per box. Should get yeah. an egg. Denver, Denver found her way. Should get an X fractor as well. Hey, Sparky. Sparky. Oh, that's uh, Gene Tennis. Gene Tennis with the uh, ace. There you go. Uh, autograph for the San Diego Padres. Aren't you glad they don't wear those uniforms anymore? San Diego. Joshua. Hey, I like, I like those uniforms. Yellow and brown, baby. Heck yeah. Classic. 81. Or Is that one of 99? That's the first one stamped. One yeah, of don't do. Exactly, El Rey. Don't do raisins. Thank you, El Ray. Walnuts. There we go. Thank you, El Ray. Good job. Uh, El Ray, you're in the lead. It's the first time I've agreed with Trevor. We pulled Boba Shet. There's his dad da. There's his dad da. Whoa, Steve Rogers. And uh, Glaber, don't call me Gleber on the X Fractor. Yet again, another reason why Dane doesn't vote, because he doesn't agree with me. Tim Lincecum, uh, two Aqua Waves in one box. I've actually don't think I've ever seen that. Usually you just get one per box. Just saying. Timmy uh, showing up strangely. Incarnacion for the White Sox. <clears throat> Otani, very nice. Otani card. I'd like to get a parallel of that. If you don't remember this set, 700 card set here. 700. Raleigh Fingers pre mustache. Nice. It's a little creepy, isn't it? Yeah, kind of. It's a little weird. It's a little creepy. <laughs> okay, Hall, I'm not going to say that. <laughs> wow. Hey, uh, CJ has that in his pocket every Wednesday. Not kidding. Rob has a... My dinner consisted of chicken broth, apple juice, getting ready for... My, okay. Getting ready <laughs> nice. for your colonoscopy. <laughs> okay. You don't win dinner talk, Rob. No. Any that's... dinner sentence that involves the word colonoscopy does not win. You got to drink that barium, Rob. Ugh. That stuff was disgusting. All right. Dinner talk's over. Got... I can't handle this. Barium. Kyle. I don't like Kyle very much today. Yeah, you guys left guard got blown up every single uh, field goal attempt during the game. And they just overloaded it. And Denver was just like, no, we're not going to help him out. He's getting destroyed every field goal attempt. You need me to come block for your team, uh, Kyle. You need me to come block for the Broncos. I'll do it. Then I'll go play receiver for the Bears. Or quarterback, excuse me. Probably be better to play quarterback. Quarterback for the Bears. King. So who's winning, Elray? Elray, definitely. Nobody else is having dinner tonight? People are no. having some gross stuff tonight. What is it, private? Nobody else can tell what you're having for dinner? Is it personal? I mean, you don't have to cook it. It can be something you ordered. If you order it out, we want to know about it. Let's go. Hey, Applebee's can beat Elroy. You know, whatever. Wherever you ordered from, they can beat Elroy too. 
I think second place right now is Jersey Mike's, so that tells you how the there's uh, no second place. How the quality of the food is in the chat. There's first place, and then there's all losers. You don't tell me how to run dinner talk. Hey, I started dinner talk. Hey, you were in diapers when I started dinner talk. <laughs> but I'm older than you. <laughs> no, you were in the other room in diapers. <laughs> I'm older than you. What are you talking? About? I'm not saying you were young. I'm just saying you were in diapers. Like that week, you were up here in diapers. <clears throat> You talking exactly. About? Why are you envisioning me in diapers all the time? Did I get my pickles open yet? Maybe. Maybe I did. No, he has to get the maintenance guy to come. Maybe and open maybe the jar Hillary for wants to open them for me. Maybe I'm gonna maybe Hillary opened them. She can't open them. Maybe maybe Hillary got out the scissors and opened them. Why are you worried about it, Carly? Why why do I have to tell you my business? Why do I have to tell you about it? Uh David Ortiz refractor. Uh, Clayton Kershaw, nice team color match here. I like this card. Clayton Kershaw, blue mini diamond. Very cool. Awesome card design for a Dodgers fan. You just randomly make noise <laughs> while we're trying to do our card break. I'm going to do that on your comic stream. I'm going to say, hey, can I call in? And you're going to be like, okay, guys, issue number 42. I'm going to go. Nah. You do it all the time. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Trev the Shipping Guru is this guy's channel. Go check it out and be very annoying when you do. Scott Rowland, he's a Hall of Famer. If you didn't know that. You don't even know what my channel is. Ty Buttery. But, but, buttery. Um, Ty Buttery. Mike Schmidt. Randy Johnson as a D-back. It looks like he's deep in thought there. As am I often. I'm, I just sit in the office deep in thought sometimes. All right, uh, Brian Anderson for the Marlins. Refractor. Manny Machado. Well, you know, Carly, I want a pony. I wanted a pony for my birthday, but I didn't see it show up. I didn't see a saddle, and I didn't see a little horsey. That explains a lot. I wanted a pony, but I didn't get one. Mark Kana. Hey, Mark Kana. He's smi He's all smiles. He's happy to be on the card. There you go, Oakland Athletics with a hit. Christopher. Christopher P.I.C. Hand-picking that auto. I want to know. That's a song. Uh, Chipper Jones. Lee Mazzilli. Looking like Liza Manilli. Lee Mazzilli. That is the scariest picture ever. Why? It looks like he's going to come after me. I, that, that terrifies me. He's All just right. a ginger. Johnny Bench. Jose Canseco looking fly. And uh, Max Kepler on the Aqua Wave refractor. Can we get the Mickey Mantle out of this stuff? It's, I know it's one in every 40 cases, which is darn near impossible, but I'd like to get one. Why not? What's up, Westy? We've opened a lot of this stuff. CC Sabathia on the X-Fractor. <clears throat> Deion Sanders, primetime. And Marcel Ozuna. This is the rose gold. A little bit of a light, uh, maybe a rose reddish tint. To it, rose gold mini diamond. I think it's to 70. No, 75. Excuse me. 75. Close enough. Yeah, exactly, Josh Van. That's what it looks like. Dane Green Bay wants a football team. Yeah, I know. They get to play the Bears this week, though. That'll that'll get you right. That'll get Green Bay right. Miguel Tejada. Cards are sticking together. All right. Uh, I like this year. This is cool. 2022 edition. I like the boxes, especially. This will be the 53 tops design, which we all know and love. Might be a little bit late for our next break, guys. Just a few minutes late. This this break takes a little bit longer. A lot of packs. The 53 and 54 are the two that were on uh, our hoodies, right? Um, 84 and 53. Oh, okay. So our blue hoodies had the 53 pack design, and our green hoodies for the Gumby event had our uh, 1984 pack design that's a little strong Carly a good football team it's a little strong how about above average how about above average it's kind of where good goes good's a little better than above average you think you got like average you got above average you got good you got great <laughs> that's yeah. way too much of a scale. yeah because you got all the below average we just got like why don't you just go one through ten like grading, yeah. Yeah. They're like uh 
Felt like a 6.5. Where's the fine in the mint? You know what I mean? What? The fine in the mint. Great fine mint? I don't think there's fine in cards. I think that's coins. Really? Yeah, there's no fine. That's coins and uh, currency. It's yeah. comics. And comics? Yeah. They have it on the graded cards that you get from CGC. You know why they fine don't put fine? Because people would go, that's fine. And you don't know what they're talking about. Exactly. That's well, fine. One of my buddies has a shirt that he made for his channel. And it's just the 6.0. It says 6.0. It's fine. It's fine. Eh. It's kind of like how you lose this thing life. on. <laughs> Day goes around, you just like, eh. This thing on. <laughs> uh, I am not getting any more of those hoodies uh, specifically, but I will tell you guys. I don't think we're gonna stock them and sell them on our website. I will direct you to homage.com. We are not affiliated with them in any way. O or h o m a g e dot com. Uh, actually, if you sign up for their email list when you go over there, I think you get a 15% off coupon. You can go order any of the Tops hoodies. Uh, you can also do like NBA Jam. They've got a Ken Griffey Jr. hoodie. Um, there's a lot more options than just the two we had. And they're super comfortable. They are super comfy. Um, I've, everybody's liked them so far. I haven't had any complaints. And I like it. And I usually, usually hoodies for me after I wash them a couple times, I don't like them. I really like these. I really like them. So yeah, go over there. They'll have all the sizes and uh, you get 15% off the first order. So if you're gonna order a few for your family, do it all at once in that first order. Um, and you'll have you'll actually have a lot more options than what we had over there. Hoyt Wilhelm. And uh, the 250, Jorge Posada looking angry. New York Yankees, that's a gold ray wave. Gold ray wave on the parallel. Beautiful. Yeah, homage.com's legit, man. They've got some nice stuff. That's who we order through, but we go through tops. We go through tops, and we do get a, a discount wholesale, but we have to buy them in bulk. Um, don't have a plan to have any more right now, so I will direct you guys over there. Freddie Freeman. And autograph, TJ Friedel, Friedel, Frudel. Going to go to the Reds. I do want to point this out, guys. Maybe a little bit of a... I don't want to call it a racing stripe. I don't know if it's scratches or imperfection in the chrome. I don't know if my camera will focus on the card. It's like just a layer of chrome. That... It looks like little micro scratches. Maybe that can be wiped off, guys. A little line. If not, you can uh, ask Tops for a replacement. L to the Ray. There you go, L Ray. You can uh, L Ray. If that doesn't wipe off, I would contact Tops see if you can get a replacement. Uh, orange wave. Yipez, 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 Yipez. Uh, there you go, uh, Cardinals. Should right. be number to 25. We've got a couple more entries into the cooking, or into the dinner. dinner. Cooking barbecue, pork sizzlers, two inch thick, honey bourbon sauce, baked taters, corn, star crunch. Westy, it's like you pull ahead. Sorry, El Ray. You pulled ahead. Trev doesn't like you, El Ray. Teddy coming in strong with the baby back ribs, homemade dirty rice and potato salad, apple pie, ice cream. Teddy, you pull ahead. No loyalty to anyone. <laughs> you pull ahead, New Teddy. New person every five minutes. Okay, congrats. You Teddy, ahead. you're in the lead. Hey, I mean, come on now. That was an upgrade and that was an upgrade. Is everyone mad on the 53 cards? Look at this. That's just because it's not their face. That's it's how, like, that's it's how like I, AI generated. That's how everyone looks when you're... Telling them they're in the lead, and then they're uh, here. Here's when you're in the lead. None of these. Why and, did they rosy up that dude's cheeks? And then they look like that. <laughs> Trevor, Trevor takes your dinner away from you. That's what you look like. You're you're angry. Uh, Robbie Ray, Robbie Ray on the green refractor to 99. I'm gonna have to go with uh, Teddy. Teddy, you're in the lead. Baby back ribs is just that's prime meat. <laughs> Why do you get the, that look on your face like these guys in the cards? It's just my face, dude. I know. You have RBF. It's the only one I got. You're about to have uh, NJF, <laughs> no job 
friend. <laughs> yeah. All right. Yeah, hey, RDF. it's the D Train. That's his nickname, Dontrell Willis. Carly's guy. Carly loves the D Train. Uh, Dontrell Willis is going to go to the Marlins. And is that number to 10? That is number to 10. Give that a boom. What insert is that? It's just a base card. It's a parallel. Doo, doo. With all those symbols on it? All aboard the D Train. Yeah, there are symbols on the back. It's little baseball players. Yeah, it's awesome. I love it. All aboard the D Train. Let me see your tickets, uh, Otani. Tickets, please. Keith Hernandez. <sighs> Seinfeld. Grinky's always mad. Yeah, that makes sense. He probably knows Trevor. All right, we've got, oh, it's number to five. What a box. Wow. Lucius Fox, who is a Batman's tech guy, right? Yeah. He runs Wayne Enterprises. He also plays baseball for the Nationals. That's a uh, red lava. Nice. There you go, Washington. Four of five. A black parallel and a red in the same box is a little strange in a good way. Um, Jake All is ATK. having Jake is having vodka and Marlboros. <laughs> Does that win? No, unfortunately. Okay. That doesn't win. That is the breakfast of champions, though. Trev, we're going to have a gold in this we're box. We're talking too. about Denver here. We're going to have a gold also. I mean, okay. Dinner, not Denver. Just talking about Denver. Christ. Uh, yeah, the, uh, the yeah, words are hard. Do you have to say the J, the JC? Do you have to say the JC? Hey, Jason Hayward. Jason Hayward gold. Is this the 50? It's the 50. The only thing we're missing here is a super fractor. <laughs> Let's get a super fractor out of this box. Let's get Trevor to, uh, you know, swear a little bit more. You're about to, like, get really excited. You're like, hey, hey, guys, hey. To 50. He's I like, know. have some more enthusiasm. Hey, why don't you say some bad words? Say some more bad words. Paul ATK with the air fried butter butterfly butterfinger air fried butterfly breaded shrimp mozzarella sticks and lemonade. That's pretty good, but it doesn't beat the baby back ribs. Dirty rice potato salad, apple pie, and ice cream. Does, That's does, just like. Does the dirty rice have onions in it? It's just a nice. No. Dirty rice does not have onions. I'm not asking you, I'm asking the chef. I think there's a shot, it's got onions. I've never had that. So would that eliminate? I'm sure there's a shot. What if he said it's filled with onions? He already has the first place. I just wouldn't eat the rice. The baby back ribs, potato salad, apple pie, and ice cream wins it. It's not over yet. No? Somebody can come in. I could take a long time to do these boxes, like 10 or 12 hours. Somebody I'm sure win. the people in the breaks will love that. They'll be happy. Because I'm spending more time on their breaks. That's what makes people happy. You are welcome, who I trade. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Not a hit, but... Carly said she's making a sandwich. Lazy. Lazy. What are you having for dinner, young Trev? I don't know. I had a huge lunch. Which was? <laughs> Which was? Red lobster. Yep. You had the shrimp? Three three different kinds of shrimp. And? <laughs> uh, baked potato and eight rolls. <laughs> eight rolls? You, did, you ate them all? Yeah. How do you eat eight rolls? It's over a time period. It's like you, that two-hour time period. You I eat ate a all. salad? No, there's no salad. They don't come with salad. So you got baked potato and shrimp, and that's it. Nothing yeah. else. Three different kinds of shrimp. I had 15 shrimp. It took you two hours to eat lunch? No, 15 shrimp, a baked potato, and eight ro eight cheddar bay biscuits. No, just the biscuits. I ate my meal and then just snacked on the biscuits for the next couple of hours. <laughs> wow. Why? Oh, wow, a two-hour sitting. Wow. It's like chips. They're just a, a nice snack. They're, just, <laughs> wow. they're so airy. They're not heavy. Good night, Irene. Somebody help me. All right. Uh, Alfonso Rivas. Alfonso Rivas. Cards kind of sticking together a little bit. Paul Molitor looking young, looking spry. Uh, Adam Wainwright on the X Fractor. Robin Roberts. You know how big the Cheddar Bay biscuits are, right? I know how big eight You guys are trying to like make me. You're trying to make me seem like I'm some. Fatty over here. No, no, no. You need your nutrients. 
You need your two-hour meal. Uh, number to 100, Mookie Betts for the Dodgers. Red Atomic. Mookie Betts. Eight Cheddar Bay Biscuits followed by, or maybe a hey, meal. Hey, wasn't, it wasn't like the dozen I ate that one day. It was a half dozen. I bet your stomach hurt for a while. Did you take a nap afterward? Of course. Oh, my gosh. It puts you to sleep. <laughs> Stuart, don't call me Morgan Fairchild. On card auto, going to go to the D-backs. Arizona doing well in our breaks tonight. Scott Gibb. Jalapeno shrimp pasta. Travis is trying to come in and take some uh, market shrimp. share here. Uh, Hunter Green in a uh, aqua. It does look like uh, like green. It's to two ninety nine. I got a free meal at Buffalo Wild Wings and a free meal at Pizza Hut, so I don't know what I'm going to have tonight. <laughs> One of those two. You gonna have anything it's gonna be, tonight? It's going to be free. Okay. I don't know. I don't think you can eat anymore. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, Bobby Witt, rookie. Dude, that's by the time we get out of here, it's like 10 hours ago, 11 hours ago. Well, no, because it was two hours to eat it. So Okay, so like nine hours. Nine ago. hours. Uh, Miguel Tejada and a 199, Trey Turner, mini diamond. Team color match. Earl Weaver. Dream Weaver. Now, I do think they reduced the base card set. That's such a weird picture here. They reduced the uh, the base card set to 500 instead of 700 uh, this year and next year, um, the, the 23. All right, we've got a, uh, I'm going to call that a green with a little baseball man around it. Green uh, to 99. It's going to be uh, Brian Miller. Brian Miller. By eating at those places a lot. Both of those places, Freddy's and uh, Mullet, Pizza Hut, about every 10 times you get a meal, you get a free meal. Wild Wings. About 10% back, I'd say. Garlic, Parmesan, Bone-In. Those are pretty tasty, Kyle. Those are pretty tasty. Uh, Will Clark. That does not look like Will Clark. Sorry. No. Looks like Will Clark uh, got a facelift. All right, we've got well, to none of these do. to seventy five. Uh, Curvin Castro. I bet he throws a curveball. Curvin Castro, Giants, Rose Gold, parallel. Seventy five. Kyle Lewis looking like a uh, stud of baseball. Sparky Anderson looking like a stud of baseball as well. Sparky Anderson. Garlic parm bone in. Is that what you order, Kyle? What he says. You just talked about it. I know. That's why I can't address him as well? Oh, you can. Okay. It just sounds like you didn't hear us when well, you do that. I don't care what it sounds like. Akil Badu. <laughs> Akil Badu. Don't mind if uh, Badu. Whatever's, whatever's happened to that guy. That guy came out. He was on fire when he first entered. Don't mind if Badu. Remember? I remember. Member? 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 I am a member. Not only am I a uh, member, I'm also the president. Is that Or is that how it goes? Not only am I a president, but I'm also a member. <laughs> Free does always taste better. So I have a theory. So rich people want to tell you how much they paid for things, like how high they paid for things. Non-rich people want to tell you what good deal they got and how low they paid for things. Have you ever noticed that? Uh, that's kind of a stereotype. I know a lot of rich people that are like the most frugal people I've ever known. I do too. That's why they're rich. But... Do I mean, you, I'm, I'm looking at one right now. No, you're not. So yeah. do you? But would you tell people if you got a nice sports car, like, yeah, I got that for twenty percent off? Oh yeah, I would too. Yeah. I'd be like, hey, I got that. I traded a baseball card for that or something. That'd be cool. I think it's smarter to tell people you got a deal than be like, hey, I paid a hundred percent for this. I paid a hundred twenty percent. Paid a hundred twenty percent of cops for that. Yeah, just because I got the money. It's I like, think sports what card. An idiot. <laughs> so sports card people want to tell you how cheap they got something for generally across the board. I think even high end cards. They want to tell you. You got stuff for cheap, for cheap is the the good way to go across the board, no matter what, because it makes you seem like you know how to get a, get a good deal. You know what I mean? I got a free meal from Carly, and then I threw it out the window. Did you say you got a free meal from Carly? No. Then everybody'd be like, "Ew." Why? Ew. Carly's, you mean she didn't have to pay you? Carly's to meals take it? look edible. I haven't ate one yet, but. They look at them. For like horses? I have I just have pickles to go off of. I don't know anything else. 
So yeah, I've noticed that though. Like, I don't think people are going, uh, hello, uh, I, I just want you to know how cheaply I got my BMW. No, I don't, I don't hear that. I do. They're like, yeah, I paid about 80 G's. Yeah, yeah, 80 G's. Because they're bragging at the same time, even though they... They're flexing? They, yeah, they're flexing. Like how Will much, Levis? How much of a deal they got and how much money they see. Dane wouldn't eat anything you made anyways. Not with all the onions in your house. It would probably have onions in it. And if you told me it didn't have onions, I wouldn't believe you. Carly's goal in life is to make me eat onions. They're probably in the pickles. You probably put a, uh, an onion in one of those. I haven't gone to the next jar of pickles, the super hot ones. I'm going to tell you why, Carly, because I want it to sit in there for a while. She put, like, serious peppers in there. I just want it to sit in there for a while. Get hot. Nice. But if there's an onion in there, I'll know it. I'll know it. And I'm constantly looking at it with like a spy glass, like a like a magnifying under magnification. Onions are good for cooking. It's just not good for eating. I have had a lot of people tell me this is their favorite of the three sets. Uh, this sold out everywhere way quicker than the other year, so I think this is really starting to catch on. Or I don't know, maybe people just like this design. There's an Otani. It's a great design. It is a great design. Uh, Liberatore, a refractor. And autograph Oswaldo. If we don't get an Oswaldo auto in every break, I actually call to make sure he's doing okay. Oswaldo Peraza going to go to the Yankees to 150. Joshua. Carl, you put onions in your cereal. <laughs> MJ, MJ Melendez. Logo Fractor, because I'm not sure what else to call it. Logo Fractor to 499. Jim Tomey, my guy. Jim Tomey. Yeah, I'm going to let that sit for a while, Carly. That jar's not getting open for a while. That's going to sit and they're going to become one. The peppers and the pickles. Uh, Groshans, Michael Conforto to 100 on the... I'm going to call that a shimmer magenta. Magenta shimmer. You should stuff the pickles with onions next time. You be quiet, Timmy. Don't give her any ideas, Timmy. She'll probably forget anyway. You can go ahead. She won't remember. Old pass break. Yeah. Packing the pack of pickle peppers. Pick a, pick a, pick a, pick a. Uh, Jock Peterson. I called him Joe one time. I don't call him Joe anymore. I call him Jock. That's to 75. Jock Peterson. Rose Gold. Jock. Cousteau. Cereal is just breakfast soup. It is. See, that's why I don't eat her food, because she says things like that. Um, <laughs> Scott Rowland, Hall of Famer, on the x Fractor. Breakfast soup. It's really not. Uh, that is Nathaniel Lowe, way down low. Nathaniel Lowe to 99 for the Rangers. Nathaniel's got a weird kind of uh, splotchy beard thing going on. It's kind of strange. I need to grow that out a little bit. Um, lefty Grove. Hey, Lefty. Uh, Mason Miller. Autograph Mark Apple. Mark uh, apple pie, Mark uh, apple of my eye, Mark uh, uh, apple doesn't fall far from the tree. There you go, Phillies. That is 76 and 99 blue refractor. Philadelphia and Raymond covered in a large amount of goo. Raymond it takes goo. You so long to talk. I'm like, well, Trev, you got to really set it up. You got to be an announcer. You can't be like Tom Brady. You can't go, oh, that guy's good. Good. He's, he's special. And then the next guy, hey, that's special. Hey, he's awesome. What a great deal. You can't do that. you got to be like, hey, Riley Green, which happens to be a green refractor, just like his last name, Green Color Money. You say things like that. You get people involved. That's how you do it. You're, you're like the Tom Brady of this group. I'm like the uh, Kevin, what's his name? <laughs> Kevin, uh, what's his name? <laughs> what's the guy's name? Kevin O'Neill? I'm his like name? Kevin. Kevin what's his name? Hart? Kevin, what's the guy's oh, name that man. is with Brady? Kevin something. Oh, that was priceless. I'm like that Kevin guy. I'm like that guy. What's his name? Kevin, yeah. <laughs> You're like Tom Brady, and I'm like that Kevin dude. Uh, gold, Josh Bell. Josh Bell, uh, 45-50. Miami Marlins. It probably is. A Appel. 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 <clears throat> it's, it's cooler to say Apple. 
Yeah, the Lions, oh my gosh, they could just give the whole game to Houston and then basically come out and just shut them down. Second, second quarterback in the Super Bowl era to throw five interceptions yeah. on the road and win the game. Yeah. I'm surprised yeah. there was another one. Yeah, right. Five interceptions and you win? That's impossible. I can't believe they stopped them to zero points in the second half. Kevin Federline? I think that's right. Kevin Federline. That may be right. Who, the tennis player? No, the Brady's co-host. Oh. The lead I analyst. Know. I haven't watched any of this stuff. I would not call Brady the lead analyst. I would call that guy the lead analyst. Where are all the Ray Lankford autos? Well, hopefully they're in this box. LeBron is garbage. What a great name. What's up, Scott? What are you doing lately, Paul? Yeah, 62. I hadn't heard from Paul a lot lately. What have you been doing, man? We miss you, Paul. Remember when I was saying, hey, I miss Paul, and you're like, yeah, whatever. Remember that? I'm, I miss you, Paul. Let me rephrase. I miss you, Paul. Kevin Federline was Britney Spears' husband. Oh, okay. It's not Federline, then. Okay. He was a handsome fellow, though, wasn't he? Was he? I don't, I don't know. I don't remember what he looked like. <laughs> um, is she still married to that guy? No. Well, then it's not her husband. Her oh, ex-husband. Ex-husband. Come on, then. Hamburger was jumping in with the Britney Spears trivia. Now he jumps in. Waits till he has expertise on something. This, that, and the other thing. I mean, that's all you can do, Paul. This, that, and the other thing. <laughs> Britney Spears' backup dancer turned baby daddy. <laughs> that's true. Uh, yep. Hey, you get close to people when you're dancing to them sometimes, especially at the club. Little humans just pop out. Oh, you're here for your Random Division National Treasures football break, which is up next. We're going to take about a 10-minute intermission after this. We're going to take a little break. We're going to stretch our legs. We're going to post a video. We're going to put these cards away. We're going to do random divisions. And I do have too long scheduled for that break, so we'll get caught up uh, during that one. Aaron Judge looking, uh, looking cool. I love this break, by the way. We're going to do this again. And I just posted composite football for Friday night. You asked for more composite. I got another case. Uh, that means two more breaks. I Five dollars cheaper than last time. Looking out for people. Five dollars cheaper than last time. I thought it was going to be more expensive. Uh, Friday night, we're doing composite. We're Scott Rowland, boom, Cardinals. Hall of Fame autograph. I always, it's, it's weird to me to say Scott Rowland's a Hall of Famer, but he just is. I like Scott Rowland. Bryce. Congrats, Bryce, on that one. The Immaculate Conception. Uh, that's funny. Ryan Sandberg, my guy. <clears throat> Getting choked up here. Uh, Jose Altuve to 99. Get out your trash cans. That's how Dane would conceive. What was that? Did you say a sentence? What? No. Dane would dig me. Uh, I'm ignoring what he said. All right, moving along. Cody Thomas. Trevor studies how I was conceived. That's his hobby. All right, Mike Piazza, my guy, to 499, Hall of Famer. Mets. I'm just here so I don't get fined. Alec Burleson to 199, rookie card. Uh, Shane McClanahan, no shenanigans on the X Fractor. Chris Oakey, Chipper Jones, Refractor, my guy. Chipper, don't call me Larry. Carly said, ew. I agree, Carly. For one time, I agree. Kyle Schwarber to 199, Phillies. Julio Rodriguez. Is that a J Rod Refractor? No, that's a base. Tony Gwynn, my guy. Catfish Hunter, nice mustache there. Max Muncie Logo Fractor to four ninety nine. Muncie Logo Fractor. Corey Hunter. Bubba Tom. This is a cool set to put together. If you're a set collector, this is these classic designs. This would be really good to put this every year, put it together, because they're going to keep advancing 
throughout all the Topps years. And my guess is they only do each one one time. So uh, William Contreras to 75. Maybe get all the refractors. Make it a little bit tougher. Uh, William Contreras for the Brew Crew. Rose Gold, 75. The two of you saying ooh is like the pot calling the kettle black. That's deep, Larry. That's right. deep. Larry knows what's up. Larry, that's deep. Larry, I can't even calculate all that. I'm going to think about that during the break here. Uh, Cal Ripken Jr. Refractor. Tris Speaker, Hall of Famer. Like it. Adolis, we call him the beast here in Texas. All card ship, every single one. Hit the thumbs up button. Hit the subscribe button. We'll be right back with National Treasures in about 10 to 12 minutes. And that is going to be Random Division. See you there.